Top 10 Muscular Dog Breeds From being the best guardians, serving as part of the police enforcement, and standing out in competitions, these canines rule the dog kingdom. These bad boys stand out for being strong and well-built. Hello guys, welcome to Epic Mojo. In today's video, we'll talk about the top 10 muscular dog breeds. Before diving in, don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe to our channel, Epic Mojo, and also turn on post notifications. Number 10, Presa Canario. Presa is a docile, caring breed. They are excellent protectors of the family and are raised both to be family friends and guardians. They are distrustful of strangers, but if the owner accepts them, they should be welcome to strangers. If required, they will be very alert and ready to defend the owner or property. Generally speaking, it is a quiet breed, but has a very threatening bark. An owner who recognizes the alpha nature of canines is necessary for the breed. The Presa Canario has a square, strong head and is almost as large as it is long. It also has a thick skin, thick bones, solid muscles, and a large head with a wide jaw. Number 9. St. Bernard St. Bernards are very powerful, tall, and muscular dogs. The dogs may be short-haired or long-haired. Their colors of coat include red and white, brown and white, and white and brindle. Some dogs have their eyes hidden with dark masks. On the head, the ears set high and are floppy. The eyes are dark and droopy, and it's got a fairly wrinkled forehead. They are also jowls of the St. Bernard, which make them prone to drooling. The height of a male St. Bernard can range from 28 to 38 inches and weigh 140 to 180 pounds. The height of a female can range from 26 to 28 inches, and she can weigh between 120 and 140 pounds. Since dogs are so large, they take longer to fully mature than many other breeds. In general, once they are 2 to 3 years old, they do not achieve their maximum size. Number 8. Doggo Argentino A large, athletic, and loyal breed is the Doggo Argentino, also called the Argentinian Mastiff or the Argentine Doggo. Both fearsome hunters and gentle protectors of their humans may be them. They have a strong desire for prey and strong will, and often a distrust of strangers and other species, all of which required the management by an experienced dog owner. Doggo Argentino was bred for strength and big game hunting, particularly for bringing down wild boars. One of the first things you notice about this dog is how big and muscular they are. The front legs are shorter than the hind legs, but that is never a disadvantage because both are equally strong. The Doggo Argentino usually has a peaceful disposition, considering its potential for violence when it comes to hunting, and it is deeply loyal to its human family. Doggo Argentino puppies, along with patient training, need a lot of physical activity and mental stimulation, otherwise they will become bored and destructive. Doggo Argentinos are often trained for police work, search and rescue, military work, and service dogs, although they are also used to assist with big game hunting. Number 7. Boxer Originally, boxer dogs were trained to be medium-sized guard dogs. Boxers today find homes as caring family friends, while they are part of AKC's working group. That said, their high energy levels are still sustained and they need plenty of exercise. Square jawed and muscular, this breed is the dog world's George Clooney a looker with a sense of humor and sweetness underlying it. They love their families and will enjoy consistent training as well. Both its well-developed legs are parallel when viewed from the front. But in life, it isn't all fun and games for these powerful doggos. Boxers are commonly used in the military and police, as well as search and rescue work, because of their strength and bravery. Boxers are outstanding watchdogs when specifically trained for guard duties and can restrain an intruder in the same way as a mastiff. In obedience, agility, and Schultzhund, boxers also excel at demanding three-phase competition events that test the tracking, obedience, and safety capabilities of the dog. Number 6. Rottweiler Originally, the Rottweilers were dogs bred to drive cattle to market. They were also used to draw carts for butchers. They were among the first police dogs in the military and served with honor. They are most importantly one of the most popular guardians and friends of the family. Parents of inexperienced pets should be alert as these dogs are strong and intense. 
They need training and affection. In a Rottweiler, owners will find a caring, loyal, and intelligent companion for life. Rotties have a strong instinct to defend their families, and their protection can be ferocious. By providing early socialization, firm, equal, consistent training and leadership, and a daily role to perform, it is important to channel their power and protectiveness. If this doesn't happen, instead of the companionable guardians they're supposed to be, Rottweilers may become dangerous bullies. Males typically have a shoulder height of 24 to 27 inches and a weight of 95 to 130 pounds. Usually, females are 22 to 25 inches tall at the shoulder and weigh between 85 and 115 pounds. Number 5. Doberman during the late 19th century, mainly bred as guard dogs, Doberman pincers originated in Germany. Their exact ancestry is uncertain, but many dog breeds including the Rottweiler, Black and Tan Terrier and German Pincher are thought to be a combination of them. This pup looks like an aristocrat with its sleek coat, athletic frame and regal presence. They are extremely energetic and smart dogs that perform well as family guardians, partners in the police, military service, and canine support. This doggo is well proportioned and built that it can be distinguished easily from other breeds. Males are 26 to 28 inches in height, females 24 to 26. Males and females weigh around 60 to 80 pounds. Males are significantly heavier than females. Number 4. Bull Terrier the Bull Terrier was initially bred as a fighting dog in the 19th century and later as trendy companion for gentlemen. But they're a family companion and a show dog these days. It's a dog breed that is characterized by its long, egg-shaped head. Bull Terriers come in a wide variety of sizes. From 35 to 75 pounds, males typically weigh 55 to 65 pounds and females 45 to 55 pounds. At the elbow, they stand between 21 and 22 inches. Bull Terrier has a fighting spirit of a bulldog and a terrier's intelligence. Number 3. Greyhound Greyhounds were initially bred to hunt hare, foxes, and deer as hunting dogs. Canines can reach speeds up to 40 to 45 miles per hour in this dog breed, making them the Ferraris of the dog world. Not surprisingly, as a race dog, Greyhounds have made a name for themselves. However, many assume that this breed is designed to run and has a destructive energy to go with it, which could not be further from the truth. The speed of a Greyhound can be found in its light muscular body. It is famous for its double suspension gallop, which is extremely flexible of its spine. Greyhounds are docile and quiet in nature, and they're world-class nappers. Due to their low indoor energy, they do well in apartments and homes with limited yards. The Greyhound is an agile, sleek breed. There are two kinds that differ more in size. Racing Greyhounds are typically 25 to 29 inches tall and show Greyhounds are slightly bigger at 26 to 30 heights an inch. Males typically weigh 65 to 85 pounds in both types, females 50 to 65 pounds, with racing dogs tending towards the lower end of the scale. Number 2. American Staffordshire Terrier the American Staffordshire Terrier is a muscular breed known for being tough for its size, but with members of the human family, they are often caring and affectionate. If they are out for a stroll, playing in the yard, or cuddling up on the sofa, American Staffordshire Terriers love nothing more than being around the people they care about. They are intelligent and willing to please, which makes them highly trainable, but they require mental stimulation because of the intellect. They'll put those solid jaws to use if they don't get it, and they'll chew something out of boredom. If they are not well trained, they may use their power to drag dog walkers along with ease anywhere they go. This means they need a good and confident trainer who, without being too harsh, can set boundaries. Male American Staffordshire Terriers are between 17 to 29 inches in height on average, while females appear much smaller at 16 to 18 inches in height. Their average weight is between 40 and 60 pounds, although some can weigh more or less. Number 1. Pitbull the American Pitbull Terrier is a companion and family dog breed. The breed grew into all-around farm dogs, initially bred to bait bulls and then brought into the house to become nanny dogs because they were so gentle around kids. Although these are pure-breded dogs, in the care of shelters or rescue organizations, you can find them. 
Mind the adoption. If you want to bring a dog home, do not shop. In the sports of weight pulling, agility and obedience, their tenacity, gameness and bravery makes them famous competitors. You will, of course, even find them living as friends, showering their people with affection and devotion. Pit bulls are often considered one of the so-called bully breeds. Pit bull is simply not a breed, but it's a term used to describe the bull terrier. The American Pit Bull Terrier, the Pit Bull Terriers have great need to chew, and cheap or flimsy toys make easy work for a strong jaw. Give yours only sturdy strong toys that can be swallowed and chewed up. Pit bulls are genetically built to be powerful and muscular. With proper diet, the pit bull can be an amazing build. Alright guys, those were the top muscular dog breeds. Comment down below your favorite bulky doggo. Also, don't forget to subscribe and turn on the bell for more updates. See you soon.